Welcome to this video tutorial about low voltage network drawing and how to calculate the current flows of your single line diagram. The single line diagram creation process explained in the previous video lets you choose between a low voltage or a medium voltage network. If low voltage is selected, the block on the scheme appears in blue. Medium voltage elements are identified in orange. With DocWeb, compared to the previous version of Doc3, the Block Diagram tab gives you a global view of the low voltage and medium voltage switchboard included in the project. You can set their properties with a single click. The Block Diagram tab also reflects the relation between the switchgears created in the other project sheets. Under the New Page tab, you can compose your single line diagram with the elements offered by DocWeb. Note that the common drop down menu contains elements valid for both low voltage and medium voltage network. To draw your low voltage single line diagram, simply drag and drop the desired elements onto the sheet. For example, you can add cables, bus bars, circuit breakers, or feeders to your scheme. Once your diagram is complete, DocWeb calculates it. To perform this step, simply click on the calculator icon up on the top to calculate the single line. DocWeb can also be set on auto calculation mode. When this mode is activated, DocWeb will compute the network at every single change. After the computation, the console feedback notifies you if an error has occurred. With the warning notification, the system displays a description to help you correct the error. Clicking on the notification opens the corresponding object properties section. If everything is well built, the feedback appears in green. At this step, the curves have been calculated and are displayed under the tab Curves Web. To find out more about curves, please refer to video number four. To access the ABB Connect Partner Hub, please visit our website at partnerhub.connect.abb.com or contact your local ABB representative. 